at Audacious Church. My name is Abigail and I go to our Chester campus. Um, I'm one of the youth leaders there um, and I'm also an Audacious College student, which is cool. Um, today I wanted to talk about growing your faith. Uh, so I wanted to start off with a little story. So a couple of years ago, I decided that I wanted to do a half marathon. Uh, don't ask me why I wanted to do it, <laughs> um, but I just did. So on the first day of training for it, I decided to do three miles. And I remember with the first mile, uh, after it, I just felt exhausted. Uh, I felt like I just couldn't go on. But I reminded myself that I had to, to get through this. Uh, so whether I was going to walk, crawl, jog, whatever, I was going to get through this three miles. Uh, so I eventually did. And I remember after it, I just felt really disappointed in myself. Because I thought, if I can hardly do this, then how on earth am I going to do a half marathon? Uh, but my dad, who is a bit of a running fanatic, um, he encouraged me and motivated me um, and just helped me to uh, continue with it. So every week I decided to continue training um, I added more miles on uh, till eventually race day came along <laughs> and I finished it. I did it in the time that I wanted to uh, and I remember just feeling uh, such an accomplishment. Especially because in the beginning it just felt such a struggle, felt like such um, like a plot well, I was plodding along. Uh, but eventually once I did it, it was just so great. Uh, so I wanted to encourage you with this verse. It says in Luke 16, 10, If you are faithful in little things, you will be faithful in large ones. But if you are dishonest in little things, you won't be honest with great responsibilities. So the reason for my story was uh, to use it to correlate it to our relationship with God. Um, I like that verse because it says how when you're faithful with the little things, it's almost like saying that the bigger things are just so much easier, so much easier to um, accomplish and to grow in. Because uh, I feel like how um, it was with me where I had to continue the training in, in order to equip myself uh, to be able to do this long run is the same kind of uh, thing that we need to do with God that we need to stay, stay consistent with the little things that we do the little uh, things that we do to show God our faithfulness so for example whether it's reading your Bible whether it's praying um, even being consistent with just coming to church uh, consistent with the things that you've promised God you're gonna you're gonna do um, with your tithing, things like that, because I feel like it shows God uh, the commitment that you have for him and the love that you, um, uh, you want to show him. Because um, if we're not doing these things, then it's almost like turning away from God and being like, oh, I can do it on my own, you know, I don't need to be ready, I don't need to be equipped. Um, but actually it's so much harder to obey God when you're not equipped in those things, when you're not continually gaining wisdom from him, when you're not trying to grow in uh, your knowledge of him. But when uh, you truly know him, when you are truly uh, equipped and ready, it's so much easier to obey. Like we know how it is when you go to <laughs> the gym. If you go one time, you're not going to get really strong. But if you um, continue with it, you're going to gain so much strength. Um, uh, and I feel like um, you being faithful opens up more do doors for great responsibility. Um, and also more opportunities and more space for miracles. Because uh, I feel like you can also use this. Um, the idea of being consistent and staying committed. Um, in the same way of um, uh, growing in a new hobby or growing in a new skill, because that increases more opportunity um, and things that God can use as well, because God uses your gifts. Um, but that is all I wanted to uh, say for this devotional. Uh, so I hope that you were encouraged that the little things that you do uh, is gonna mean so much more in the long run, that you're gonna grow uh, so much greater in your strength and in your relationship with God. Um, but yes, 
That's all from me, so I hope you have a great day.